Reaction this afternoon to a state lawmaker's voter fraud charge. Republican State Representative David Cole bonded out of jail yesterday afternoon, shortly after being booked. He's been accused of voting in the wrong district. Now, we just received this statement from the Madison County Democratic Executive Committee. Chair Sheila McNeil says, quote, voter fraud is an assault on democracy. McNeil added, Cole is not the only one to blame. She says the state legislature could have corrected the issue. McNeil says, quote, the GOP dominated House of Representatives apparently more concerned about politics and power than the voters of House District 10 declined to do so. Now we are working to learn more information about this case, but we know this isn't the first time Cole's residency has been questioned. During the 2022 District 10 election, Democratic nominee Marilyn Lands also questioned where he lived. She claimed he lived outside the district. Tax records show Cole lived in a home on Cedar Springs Place in Madison, that is in District 4, but it all changed right before the campaign filing deadline. Lease documents surfaced showing Cole signed a rental agreement for a home in District 10. Alabama House Speaker Nathaniel Ledbetter released a statement on Cole's charge. It reads in part, in recent years, the Alabama House has prioritized legislation that promotes election integrity, and we believe that any fraud allegation must be addressed regardless of the party, public official, or candidate involved. We did reach out to Cole's office and we were told to contact his attorney.